Coogan Cassius, IFL TV here in Brayhead for He Who Dares. First of all, Stephen, your mum just collared me in the out there and said she told me to tell you she loves you. Okay. So I thought I'd drop that in first. Love you too, mum. Okay. Fantastic fight, and you ended it emphatically in that in that last yeah, round. Yeah. Well, Danny gave me a big ball in the in the corner midway through. He says, "You're uh, you're you're slightly behind. You need to start pulling out, uh, working behind the jab." But I was uh, a bit stiff early on and tried to load up too much and sort of slightly just dropped behind but it wasn't, it wasn't too far out. Uh, I know the judges had me behind going in the last round but uh, going in, coming back after six, uh, seven rounds then it's like you need to win these last few rounds, you need to win them. You want to keep your title, you need to win them. And then going back after the ninth, he's like let's do this, you've got them. And Danny told me I would stop him and I did. You were getting through some good shots of your own, were you hurt? At any stage of that fight? To be honest, I think uh, Waddy's power overrated. Um, he was he was landing some heavy shots and never phased me once. A lot of them were catching the gloves. That's why I've got a mark on that side. I think he, he got through with a couple there, but this that's just covering up. But I think I think the power's overrated, and the boys have been falling over. This whole build-up has been kind of drawn out. Has it played a, a part psychologically for you? Like, has it been psychologically draining, this whole build-up with Roddy? Mm, it was a bit. Uh, it was a bit, uh, but I had to uh, control myself. Uh, I got a bit heated yesterday in that, but that's, that's just how it is. Uh, he was speaking there at the end there, and he wants to uh, get me in the call, and he, want, he wants to apologise for being disrespectful. Is that what he was saying to you when he sort of pulled yeah, you? Yeah, we were yeah, we just saying, Let, let's draw a line, we're both fighters. And uh, we should have respect for each other. So hopefully that's taught him a lesson, uh, and he'll be more respectful. He might get more of his career if he's more respectful and not too big-headed. Uh, but they used to be friends, Kiki. What up, mate? I've seen that picture. Out. That was a bit hairy, wasn't it? Indeed. Hard to tell lines, are they? You were down yeah, two rounds was it? on two cards, and that's why I won on L. But listen, what heart of ten lions, he who kneels before God can stand before anyone. But you know, listen, to draw, he asked you to draw a line on this whole Simmons Camacho. You're prepared to do that, obviously. Yeah, I'm, I'm prepared to drop it. There's no point in dragging things on. Yeah, God, God uh, says you should forgive, and so I'll forgive. Hmm. You've had a great win uh, tonight. You're still unbeaten. What's next for you, Stephen? Don't know. We'll see what Eddie's got up, up his sleeve. Hopefully, he'll do a big show in Edinburgh. What are you asking now? Eddie, why Eddie, Eddie, what's next for Stephen? Uh, a little rest. He's got to spend some time with his. Yeah. With his we can't go to Hamilton till December. October. October, but probably Glasgow. Maybe not Edinburgh just yet. He got a win in <laughs> Edinburgh Castle, apparently. Yeah, yeah. 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 before yeah. the tattoo or after the tattoo. Yeah. Uh, we sling, sling this big man in next. Well done, Danny. We've got a message for you. You're great support here. Ah, uh, uh, thanks very much. Support pulled me through in the end, and the great words by my coach Danny uh, Hello. got deep inside, and uh, I'm uh, much appreciated of the support, and let's hope it carries on. Uh, I'll never, I'll never disappoint them. And also, do you want to thank your sponsors in particular, MGM? Yeah, I want to thank uh, MGM for everything they've done. Uh, I never got a chance to thank them on uh, Sky. I got halfway through my sponsors and then, right, not, 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 I just got out of the fight. But uh, yeah, thank MGM for everything they've done. Daniel, Taff, uh, Anto, uh, Chris, the great boys, and uh, all the lads in Slanchy. Uh, I want to thank Dentman Fall of Trucks, Giant Eye Scaffolding, Woodroofing, uh, Scottish Solar. Uh, Select, <laughs> select, select blinds and uh, trend clothing and uh, anybody who wants a bathroom go Victor Paris because if you want to make your home in Paris that's where you need to go <laughs> all right thanks for that um I, I just want to pick up MGM as well do you, want a bathroom? There. do you need a bathroom uh I don't actually do you know what I don't know I don't I don't <laughs> so. but uh, listen well done great win for you and uh you're going to enjoy the rest of the night now, can't you? Thank you. Cheers. Right. Double celebration tomorrow. Meal with my, my beautiful wife, Nicole. Uh, and uh, I'm looking forward to it. I've got, got to have a drink for the wedding. I never had a drink over the wedding, so I'll make up for it tomorrow. Absolutely. Thanks for inviting me to your wedding, by the way. Oh, well, I thought you'd be too busy, cook. Never You've too never busy. got time. <laughs>
I love a wedding, especially when a we, boxer's when, wedding. When we, when we new, renew the vows sometime, we'll, we'll invite you then. Yeah. Or if I get married before that. Then. Will you invite us to your wedding? We'll find a bird first, calm down. I right? thought <laughs> <laughs> you were a ladies man. No, no, but not, not marriage material. <laughs> They're not, by the way. Alright, Stephen, thanks for talking Cheers. to us. Cheers, and uh, catch up with you soon, alright? Thank you. Thank you.